first of three between the Padres and the Marlins in Miami. Kip Wells on the hill for San Diego as he gets some early defensive help from a former Marlin, Cameron Maven. Ryan Peterson, the fly ball into Shell, the right center. Check out the effort of Maven here as he extends to his left and makes the fantastic grab. Peterson knows he was robbed of a hit there. Nice job by Maven as our game is still scoreless after two. But in the home half of the fourth, the Marlins would strike first. It is Jose Reyes at the plate as he promptly extends his hitting streak to 14 games. This will go as an RBI triple into the right field corner as it scores Donovan Solano. The Fish have the 1-0 lead. Reyes would then score later in the frame to give the Marlins a 2-0 lead. Let's move to the top of the sixth. It's now a 2-1 game. It is Carlos Zambrano on the hill. Base is loaded, though, facing Yasmani Grandal. And Grandal puts one in the air to center field, and that's over the head of Ruggiano all the way to the wall. Here comes Guzman to score. Right behind him, Henley. Right behind him, Quentin. To third is Grandal. He's cleared the bases. 4-2 Padres. The hometown kid comes through. Grandal played his college ball at the nearby University of Miami, and as it turns out, so did the next batter, his teammate, Yonder Malonzo. He comes through with the ribby single of Chad Gaudan. That scores Grandal. The Padres have a 5-2 edge. They would send 11 men to the plate in a five-run sixth inning. Moving now to the home half of the six with two men away. Kip Wells continuing to go strong for the visitors. He strikes out Brian Peterson, who cannot get any lumber on that one. That would end Wells' outing. He goes six, five hits, two earned, and he strikes out four. Let's move to the top of the seventh, now a 6-2 game. Cameron Maven did it with his glove earlier. Let's see if he can do it with the bat against Dan Jennings. There's a high fly ball to left field. Morrison heading back. He can't make that play. It's going to one-hop against the fence. Here comes Grandal to score on a double by Cameron Maven. It's now 7-2 Padres here in the seventh. And that would be your final score in this one as Kip Wells picks up his second win of the season. After six solid innings of work, the Padres notched their 20th come from behind win this season, accounting for nearly half of their 43 total wins. And the Hurricane boys, Grandal and Alonzo, drive in five of the Padres' seven runs.